Hi, I'm Dr. David Kent. I'm an assistant professor of otolaryngology here at Vanderbilt University, and today we're going to be talking about sleep apnea. What is sleep apnea? Everybody's muscles relax at night, and that includes the muscles of the throat. In some people, the muscles of the throat relax enough that the throat actually starts to collapse, and that leads to airflow restriction and snoring. A patient with sleep apnea might not actually even know that they snore. They might be told by a friend or a bed partner that they're snoring. Some people actually feel tired during the day as well because the airflow restriction leads their brain to wake up overnight, disrupting sleep. What are the symptoms of sleep apnea? As I mentioned before, the most common symptoms are snoring or feeling tired during the day, although not everyone actually feels tired. Sometimes the airflow restriction overnight is enough that people actually snore themselves awake. They might not know that it was snoring that woke them up, but they keep waking up throughout the night. Why is it important to treat sleep apnea? Well, most patients with sleep apnea come to see me for treatment because they feel tired, and treating it can help them feel better during the day. But not everybody who's got it actually does feel tired. And it turns out that sleep apnea is also associated with pretty common downstream health conditions like high blood pressure, diabetes, or an increased risk of stroke or heart attack. And treating the sleep apnea can actually help reduce the risk of those conditions. How is sleep apnea treated? All the treatments that we have for sleep apnea are designed to keep the throat from collapsing overnight. One of the interesting parts about my job is that there's a lot of different ways to do that. The main treatment that we have for sleep apnea is what's called a CPAP machine. It's a small mask connected to a machine that provides some air pressure to help keep that throat from collapsing overnight. But if that's not working for patients, we have a variety of other medical and even surgical treatment options as well. What is upper airway stimulation therapy and how does it work? You might remember earlier that I mentioned that sleep apnea happens when all the muscles of the throat relax at night. Upper airway stimulation therapy involves a small device implanted inside the body that helps keep muscle tone up in the throat, specifically the tongue muscles. In the U.S., we currently have one approved device that you may have heard of before called Inspire Therapy. Making an appointment's easy. You can call the office at 615-322-6180, or you can visit us online at vanderbilthealth.com slash sleep surgery. I'm Dr. David Kent with Vanderbilt Health. If you've got sleep apnea and you're struggling with CPAP, you're not alone. Make an appointment as I think we can help. Thanks for listening.